Welcome back to the 2023 Summer Series event number five with Trigger King RC Monster Truck Racing. This is high flying, fast paced pro mod monster truck action as we take a look at qualifying highlights for bracket number one, Firestone Bigfoot, then Manic, and setting the tone yet again, Grave Digger driven by Josh Rhodes. We've got a big field of 29 trucks racing in our pro mod bracket. So we won't see the number one qualifier, Gravedigger, for a while. He's got a buy in round number one, but we've got a lot of trucks that don't have buys. So we're moving into action straight away. The 16-17 matchup, underpowered Andy Salerno and Bigfoot 13, Chris Blank. Salerno takes the first victory of the day in Pro Mod competition. Drivers ready. Next out on the line, Taurus versus We the People. Taurus with a tremendous jump. Taurus, a smooth and easy winner. A little bit of a short, choppy track here. Not a lot of obstacles, but not a lot of space to run either. Next, it's Rockstar, the number nine, against number 24, Indominus. Indominus, second in points. Not a great showing in qualifying, and neither of them with a great showing right now. Rockstar makes the fewest number of errors and moves on. Bigfoot Nation, an ACRC truck driven by John Arnold this time out, and Boogie Bug. <laughs> Bigfoot Nation taking the win. From Colorado, Mad Dog, driven by Troy Haas. Facing Buggin' Out, driven by Mike Bufka. Bufka in a ride we've not typically seen him piloting. Bufka. Troy, very familiar with Mad Dog, but right towards the finish line on that final jump. He missed it with the front two tires and gives the win to Buggin' Out. The number five qualifier, Big A's, Andy Salerno, and the number 28 qualifier, Equalizer, Chris Parrish. Also up in the points with a bad showing in qualifying. But a great showing in round number one as Equalizer moves to round number two. Drivers ready. Watch the light. El Toro Zombie Hackinson in the far lane. Oh! I think that may have been a red light. Zeus waiting patiently on the line. That was a red light by Hackinson in the far lane, giving Iron Aaron James in Zeus an easy victory. A new truck on the series. Lotion Commotion, driven by Isaac Ankrum and Reckless Intent, Josh Rhodes. Wow, it was close, but Lotion Commotion takes the victory. He'll be rocking on into round number two. Drivers ready. Hellion and Grave Digger, a newcomer in the far lane in Grave Digger. Hellion. We saw Aaron already on the track and looking smooth with Hellion as he commonly does. He's sitting fourth, I believe, in points. A great save in the far lane. He's not going to move on, but he had his moment here today. Yeah. Sudden impact and retro Bigfoot. Oh, sudden impact in trouble, hitting a turn marker. And Keith Voigt in retro Bigfoot takes the victory. Sudden impact was third in points, so some big points implications with only two events remaining in the season. Number 14 and number 19, Careless Whisper and Awesome Kong. 
Troy's been looking good with Kong lately and looking good in round number one of Pro Mod Action moves into round number two. Last couple pairs in round number one. Number six, Angels Bigfoot, Bob Chandler and Ford Monster, driven by John Wald, the number 27 qualifier. Angels sitting fifth in points for the season, gathering more valuable points as he moves on. And our final pair of round number one, the 11 versus the 22, Ripper John Arnold and USA One, Keith Boyd. Neck and neck, but both trucks a little out of shape. Ripper a little less out of shape. Takes the win while USA One finishes in classic USA One style. <laughs> Moving on into round number two. Yep, this will right be here. our first time go. to see Gravedigger Josh Rhodes, the fast qualifier on the track racing. He's facing off with the number 16, Underpowered. Underpowered in the lead. Oh, but wide through the final corner. And Josh Rhodes takes advantage, putting Gravedigger in the next round. Tara sitting seventh in points. Facing off against Rockstar, Isaac Ankrum. Ankrum, always tough. Oh, and Mark hits a turn barrier, but so does Ankrum. Everybody's out of shape. Taurus is upside down, but over the finish line. He wins this round, but he's gonna need to do better than that to continue through the bracket. Drivers ready? Bigfoot Nation and bugging out. Something dramatically wrong in the far lane, but now something wrong in the near lane. Buffka recovers and carries bugging out to round three. Drivers ready? Yeah. On the line, number 28, yeah. Equalizer, Watch versus light. number 21, Zeus. Zeus with an easy ride in round number one. Equalizer not going to have lane choice all day long as he is <laughs> next to last in the seating, but takes the victory and moves on. Drivers ready? Yeah. Lotion Commotion Watch and Manic. Manic, the number two qualifier against the brand new Lotion Commotion. Come on, come on. Ooh, that's close at the finish line. Taking a look at the TK replay. Power down towards the finish line. And there I think you see it, Manic by most of a wheel, takes the victory in a close race. Drivers ready? Hellion, facing Watch off with Bigfoot Retro. Hellion looked really smooth, pulling a wheelie off the starting line. He was good in round number one, looking pretty good in round number two. Smooth and steady as he takes the win. Number three, Firestone, Bigfoot, Bob Chandler, and number 19, Awesome Kong, Troy Hogg. Starting to see the trucks pull wheelies off the starting line. I think the starting line is going away a little bit as these awesome powered pro mod trucks are digging out the starting line and creating more dirt lip on the ramp. That'll be interesting to see how that plays out throughout the course of the bracket. Our final pair in round number two, Angels Bigfoot and Ripper, John Arnold. Ripper in all kinds of trouble, giving Bigfoot the easy victory. <laughs> Moving on to round three, number 28, Equalizer, and number 20, Bugging Out. Big wheelie for bugging out, out of shape for Equalizer out of the first corner. It's tight. Ooh, it was kind of sketchy heading towards the finish line. Both trucks in the air, but Equalizer wins this round. Our number one qualifier, Grave Digger Josh Rhodes and Taurus Jeremy Mark. 
Neck and neck. Mark gets off the corner better and takes the victory, putting the number one qualifier on the trailer. Looked up, right? All right. Drivers ready? Drivers ready? Number two, Manic, and number seven, Hellion. This could be a dynamite race. Manic with the jump, but Hellion out of the turn well. But Manic got the advantage out of the second turn and led all the way to the finish line. Firestone Bigfoot will take the win over Angel's Bigfoot. Chandler choosing the number one truck in points, Firestone, to move on. Drivers ready? Yeah. Watch the light. Semi-final action, final four already. Number eight, Taurus, and number 28, Equalizer. Still alive. Wow. That was a awkward race. Both trucks a little out of shape, hitting that final obstacle. Taking a look at the TK replay. Both trucks trying to put the power down. Equalizer washing out, then Taurus washing out. It looks like both trucks hit the obstacle with the front axle and launch straight up in the air. But there you see it. Wow, that was crazy. Equalizer takes the victory. It was almost as if the trucks were just fighting to see if one of them would get to the finish line. Drivers ready. Watch the other side of the semifinals. Number two and number three, Manic and Firestone Bigfoot. Firestone in trouble and the points leader goes down, but he accumulated a number of points in this bracket, making it to the semifinals. But Manic looking solid. And setting up the finals, number two, Manic versus the number 28 qualifier, Driver Equalizer, ready. coming from the bottom. Watch the light. Equalizer a little bit of a lead off the first corner. Uh, Equalizer with the power down and taking the victory in Pro Mod bracket number one from an incredible 28th position. That'll help Equalizer gain some ground in the points as Equalizer was sitting in sixth, trying to gain ground on a potential podium position. We'll see how the point story continues to evolve in round number two, bracket number two of event number five. It should be exciting. It's neck and neck here. So you never know what's going to happen. It'll be exciting to see how this all plays out through the remainder of the season. We appreciate you joining us on TKRC TV. Join us next time. We'll see you then.